Alright, this time it's going to be on XFC, and they actually have this patch uh, for a while now uh, that allow you to do toweling, or aka arrow snap kind of thing, aka comp his grid, or aka the K-win uh, toweling thing, alright? Anyways, uh, I'll give you an example here. So you have a Windows, and you want to tile it, um, you know, here this side, this side. It doesn't go full screen when, uh, or I mean, maximize your screen when uh, you go up top. It just does the, you know, the horizontal half. Same thing for the bottom, right? So it's kind of like the the comp his grid style. And when you do this over here, if you go like to the the top, it will just do, you know, that uh, rectangular little box here. Same thing for this side and this, right? So that's the tiling that they have for this patch, and. Um, Oh yeah, if you're one of those person that does like, you know, if you want if you're one of those person that does like a power push, like if you go boom like this really hard, um by default they have this in their settings, so you might want to disable this if you're one of those person that has accidents. Uh go to your setting manager here and go to Windows Manager and go to advanced. Um and right here this is the default, it's checked it. Now, when this one is checked, it it basically um, you know goes to a different uh, workspace. If you go all the way over, right, this is our different workspace. You can see that this is the old one. This is the new workspace. But you know, if you want this person that you know does it really hard, then it goes off the screen and it goes to the next uh, workspace. Uh, then you might want to disable this, so it will not carry over to you know the other workspace. But I mean, if you do it softly. I mean it does work but you know some people that they do really hard and it goes to the next workspace so it might be annoying okay if you want to have that on or off just depends on you right but that's where it is in here is it's in the advanced option of your Windows uh, manager settings uh, so that's basically it uh, if you want to get it for your XFCE um, what, what are we on here Ubuntu Alright, you can actually just go add their PPA in, which I'll put in the link in the description somewhere. And after you add the PPA, make sure you do, um, what was it, a sudo app get uh, update. Do an update. This will refresh the list after you add in your um, PPA. And then, um, I'll wait for this to finish here. And then after that, all you gotta do is do sudo apt uh, git install xf uh, wm4, and when you do this, it'll just uh, you know give you the update version because um, you know that's the one with the patch that they have for it. Anyways, that's how you would install that. Just add the PPA, do an update, and then uh, you know install it to upgrade it. So that'll be it for this one.